<coughs> so Nathan, there seems to be something about uh, trips to Broadhurst Park that bring around these uh, topsy-turvy uh, crazy games. Uh, another example of that this afternoon. Action replay last season, wasn't it? Um, but what a game for the neutral, I think. Um, we played against the best football inside this league by quite a long way. They used the pitch really well. Um, we've had chances, they've had chances. Um, they've had everything in the game and on the balance of play, you know, I'm really happy with a, with a one or a two all draw. Yeah, and uh, looking at the first half, um, his effort started brightly, but um, Whitby, throughout the, most of the uh, first half, I mean, it's defending well and uh, getting themselves a lead uh, through Lewis Hawkins and a really well worked uh, yeah, we, piece of play there. Yeah, we had, we, listen, we had a game plan. Um, game plan was working, we contained them pretty well. They didn't really carve us open by a couple of mistakes, and Blandy was there. As he always is to, you know, to get us out of trouble, really. Uh, but the goal was well taken, you know. And at that point, we're always in control. I think, and even going into the second half, but we've we've let them get back into it with a cheap penalty, haven't we? So, you know, we've adjusted, and like I say, we've held out well in the end. Yeah, and uh, looking at the start of that second half, you mentioned about the uh, penalty, but on the back that came on the back of a good chance of Malik Dykes, a well, a double opportunity for him. Yeah, it was. Listen, he, he was. He went on the pitch to do exactly what he did, um, and if he was fit. You know, there's, there's every chance he'd have started the game today because we know what he's good at, we know what he can do, but he wouldn't have seen the game out. So he went and did exactly what we wanted him to do. Um, great run, committed the man, broke the line, played on the front foot. Um, great slip to uh, Fuse, he's still got a lot to do, but he scored the goal. But yeah, totally, like I say, we caught him cold, but then they've done the same to us at the other end. So. Yeah, I'm going to have to touch obviously, on the penalty, uh, how it came about. And it seems to be a theme, uh, something that we've noticed quite a bit this season. It's very similar challenges, uh, naive as a word we used. and. You know, eighth penalty of the season already in January, it's something that I'm sure you'll be keen to work on defensively. Yeah, well, it's it's something boys have to reflect on, really. Um, it's basic defending. If you commit yourself, any half decent forward player is going to go to ground. Um, you've just got to stand up. And yeah, it was a cheap penalty. It's let him get back into it. But like I say, we've, we've got to reflect on that. And it's something we will address again. Um, but yeah, it's just one of them things. We can't turn back time. We've got to deal with it. We dealt with it. And like I say, we're, we've come out with a decent point again. Yeah, and we had the, the perfect response from that goal straight to the end of getting ahead, but then the frustrating aspect is that FC yeah. then did exactly the same to Whitby as well. Yeah, very frustrating from our side of things, but again, it wasn't, we weren't carved up and it was just a split second decision from Danny, you know, on his clearance to put it back into a danger area. And luckily it's fell to their lad and it's a directly goal. It happens, yeah, we're not gonna we're not gonna look back on that. It's it's one of them things in football, if it had gone our way we'd have been happy with it. Um but I'm I'm just more than happy with the character the lads have showed. Um the endeavour um, and the togetherness out of that to get through that game in the end. Yeah, and you know, as I mentioned, they could have potentially lost it with the chance or could have won it as well. Uh, plenty of positive to take out of it and back at home Tuesday yeah. night as well. And um, obviously, a different type of game against guys. Yeah, well. listen, I'll, I'll repeat, they, they've had chances FC today, no doubt about it. And they'll, they'll do that all year round here. And there's a reason why they've got a, a very good plus record in the goal section. Um, but we've had our chances as well, and then all that and a bit better finishing the goal. The, the goals of Joel Sturridge game, so it's just one of those things. But like I say, I'm I'm very happy with the lads today. The, the work rate, the endeavour, everything that they've done, you know, everything that we talk about, they've gone and and, and done that. So we'll again, we'll, we'll look forward to Tuesday, another hard game um, against Geisley, and uh, yeah, same application and. You know, we'll give them a good game. Yeah, in terms of your team selection for that one, we saw a couple of changes in the second half. Uh, very tap minded, uh, the sort of quicker players like to get it down the deck, and um, that's probably not going to be possible Tuesday night. Um, so, how does that sort of play into your selection, perhaps, for that one? No, listen, no, we'll, we'll play the game as we see it. Um, need to obviously see the pitch on Tuesday, uh, see how much rainfall with how heavy it is. Um, but it's, just, it's all about courage. You know, we, we didn't want to settle for a point, we wanted to go get the win, and you know, my changes, you know, would show that. Um, sometimes attacks the best form of defence. We've done that today, and you know, guysly on um, on Tuesday night. Whatever the conditions are, we'll be putting a team out to go win the game. 